Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Today we're going to be taking a look at my top 5 most favourite registry cleaners on Windows. And to kick things off in 5th place, we have Logic's Registry Cleaner. And as you can see, it's on my screen right now. We're going to be putting a lot of these registry cleaners to the test and at the very end, we will see who managed to detect the most registry keys on the scanners. I'm going to go ahead now and hit scan. As you can see on the left hand side, it's got a nice little layout here. We've got a tree view. We can select what we want to scan just by ticking each box here, which is really nice. It's nice and simple. Everything's there. We've also got rescue center. If we just click on that for a second, we can create a backup of our registry. We can also click onto restore points and create a restore point if we want, which is definitely something you want when messing around with the registry as cleaning up the registry, it could end up making your computer go wrong. It's just a risk you end up taking if you're not careful. I'm going to go ahead now and press scan now and we're going to see how many registry keys this program actually does find. Right, the scan is finished and the results are in. And as we can see at the bottom right hand corner here, this program managed to find 689 problems with our registry. It's got a nice little layout here, as you can see. It says on the right hand side here, we've got low to normal and then it would go to high. If we click on the actual folder, it lists all the registries as we can see there and it gives us a nice little description on the right hand side as well if we just bring that over folder does not exist which is typical when you install a game then you uninstall the game or same with a bit of software you install some software and then you uninstall that bit of software the uninstaller doesn't always remove all the registry keys overall it did find a lot of programs and that's great it means that the program is working and next up, in fourth place, we've got Slim Cleaner. This is a great program. It's definitely worth a try if you want a alternative cleaning program for your Windows. It's free, which is also great. The only issue that I do find with this program is everything's already selected, all the values. And then because I'm trying to do a registry video right now, I had to go through each tab and unselect everything individually, which can be quite frustrating when you just want to simply do a registry clean and also I've now got to as you can see I can't click on the top here to select all I've got to individually go through and select each option but it's only a little minor thing I suppose so we're not going to take that into account of knocking off the score we're now going to go ahead and hit analyze and see how well this program performs and how many errors it finds Straight away, as you can see, it's only found 191 results, which is incredibly less than our last registry cleaner. I will put all the results at the end of this video. And next up in third place, we have C Cleaner. It looks fairly similar to Slim Cleaner. But we've got two separate tabs for our cleaner and our registry cleaner, which means that anything that's selected in the cleaner, it doesn't affect the registry section. So we ain't got to go through and deselect everything like we did in Slim Cleaner. I'm going to go ahead now and smash that scan for issues button and we'll just see how many registry errors C Cleaner detects. And straight away, as you can see, it loaded really fast. It didn't take long to scan, but unfortunately, it hasn't found many registry errors. There isn't a number at the bottom, but I will go through and find out the number for the end of this video. And in second place, we have Assuring Free Registry Cleaner. This really is a fantastic registry cleaner. It, it probably is one of my most favorite. Don't be tricked by the look of the graphics. I know they're very old school. It's got an old gooey look to it. Everything is really like in the top right hand corner here. Check for updates. It's just really old school. But overall, it's not actually down to how the program looks. It's down to how well the program performs. Let's go ahead and click on scan registry issues. 
and which is see how many issues this program does find. Normally it finds hundreds when I run it on machines that haven't had a clean up for a long time. And as we can see, the program has found 732 problems. To be honest, that is a lot of problems that it's managed to find, and it's done pretty well. Especially considering how old the program looks, a lot of people would take one look at it and think, I'm not giving this program a go. And in first place, we have the king of registry cleaners. We have Wise Registry Cleaner 9. And straight away, as you can see, we've got three options here. We've got a fast clean, a deep scan, and also a custom area scan. And the GUI, it looks really nice as well. Everything just fits. I do like the look of this program. And to top things off even more, up the top here, you've even got a registry defrag which just makes this program even more fantastic. Let's go ahead now and click deep scan and see how well this program performs. And the results are in. As we can see, Registry Cleaner 9 has found 1,004 problems. It has outdone all the other registry cleaners and straight away as well look how nicely that is laid out all the icons the text everything it just looks superb and now i'm going to bring up another screen with all the results so you can look at them all on one page i hope this video helped if it did hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials